You talked earlier on that the USA and Israel work hand in hand together, committing war crimes and breaking international laws. And I know that the US, USA gives over a billion dollars to Israel annually. And we as US citizens, we just paid, we recently just did our taxes. And I couldn't help but think, wow, some of my tax money is going to go to Israel to help kill my family and friends in Palestine. And then as Americans, we go and try to enter Palestine slash Israel, and we were given denied entry. And our American citizenship are stripped away from us, and we give no, they give us no reason why. Like, they give no explanations. Denied entry, and that's about it. Who are you referring to? I guess a lot of my friends and families who are not necessarily Palestinian Americans, but also Asian Americans and African Americans. Are just not allowed in, not allowed entry, you mean? Yeah, are given denied entry, but are given no explanations. And that's the least of it. Yeah, that's, actually there's, there are a few Jews who are not allowed entry, like Richard Falk, the UN rapporteur for Gaza or Norman Finkelstein, you know, maybe others, Americans, you know, uh, who happen to be Jewish. Uh, but uh, sure, that's bad. But, you know, that doesn't begin to compare with the crimes that are being committed in the occupied territories. Uh, and certainly when, you, when American citizens pay taxes, uh, not only are they helping fund Israel, but though they don't know it, they're funding an organization which is committed by law in Israel to work for the benefit, only for the benefit of people, I'm quoting, of, of Jewish race, religion, and origin. And that organization is not a small one. It happens to control about 90% of the land in Israel. And Americans are contributing to that because that organization has tax-free status. It's called the Jewish National Fund. I mean, would you want to contribute to an organization that uh, is bound by law to in, say in the United States to uh, uh, control 90% of the land for the benefit of people of you know white uh, religion, race, and origin or something. I mean, that's kept very quiet because if Americans knew anything about this, uh, they wouldn't like it. You know? So, okay, that's the task of uh, people who care about the world, let people know. <laughs>